Hello beautiful, so our angels are already here to give you our guidance for next week. It will be the week of the 10th through the 16th of September 2018. And if this is your first time here, remember quickly to go to the subscribe button below, click on the bell right next to it, so you receive notifications whenever a new angel guidance or a new Reiki healing or any kind of video that is coming to help you connect with your angels, to help you connect with your own heart. Whenever a new video comes up, you will be notified. And for those of you who don't know me yet, my name is Maria. It's a pleasure to receive you here in my channel, to receive you with our angels, to receive their love and their guidance for next week. And as I was saying, we're going to be doing our guidance uh, for the 10th through the 16th of September. I will be using the Garden Angel Tarot Cards. This is by Doreen Virtue and Redley Valentine's. It's such a lovely deck. The cards are beautiful. The messages are so cute. I love working with this deck, so beautiful. Uh, we have 78 cards in this deck. It's a very thick deck. There are many cards, very good to use. Actually, this was originally made for kids to be working with angel cards, but of course, we also love it. So we are going to be using this deck for this week. Okay, my dear. So as always, I ask you to close your eyes. Let's start connecting with the angels now. Inviting their guidance, inviting their love, their light to surround us, to touch the cards, uh, to speak through me and give you the right guidance, the right message for the energy of this week, to, give you, to bring you a little bit of support, a little bit of understanding about yourself and about your week. So let's get the cards for Monday and Tuesday first. Let's see what comes forward. I'm going to go, okay, it's here. They're already telling me to stop. So, oh. Three cards. You know, you know me. If you have been here for a while, you know that my guidances are usually quite long. They keep, they keep doing this. I can't, I can't stop it. But anyways, first card, Eight of Abundance, and it's saying, this is a time of learning and owning your skills. You may feel inspired to go back to school, take seminars on topics that fascinate you, or educate yourself on the healing arts. This is a good time to change jobs or make a career move. The key to success is in the details. Monitor your projects carefully. My dear, this is actually the card talking mainly, the energy is mainly about trainings, mainly about courses, going for a lecture, doing something to improve your knowledge, to improve yourself, your own understanding in any area. This can be to make you better at your work, make you better at something you already do or learning something completely new that is resonating with your heart right now that you feel drawn to learn more about it. So take the opportunity, if there is something coming up this week that you would like to be doing, you would like to be um, starting, remember to go for it. Remember that the energy is protecting you in this matter and is bringing you to the right training, to the right teachers, to the right courses, to the right lectures, online seminars, anything in this regard. Remember to go for it, okay? This is a perfect time that the energy is working towards helping you to achieve your goals, towards helping you to get to where you want. So if you have the opportunity to make or to do some kind of course, some kind of training, even reading a book, even a book, if there is any book that you would like to read about something to deepen your knowledge, go for it. Take the opportunity that, like I told you, that the energy this week is in this direction. So you will be 100% sure that whatever you're reading, whatever you're doing, whatever you're deciding to begin, the training you're deciding to start, you will know that this is going to help you on your purpose. This is going to help you in aligning yourself uh, with your heart. So remember this week to go for any kind of training, anything that you're thinking about doing. Search about it, okay? They're telling me about this as well. If something came to your mind and you feel like doing, a, doing, doing this training, at least start searching about it, start looking for it. 
okay it's not gonna fall in your hands you have to search about it you have to know and understand where this is being held and what you should be doing and all of this okay all of the information you need about the training so go for it remember search about it or if the opportunity is already there you have to go for it okay my dear the next one ace of action talking about action this cherub is heralding a time of wonderful new opportunities related to your creativity your career or pursuing your dreams that's exactly what i was talking about this is a card of action so if you've been procrastinating it's time to really get busy. It's also a great time to start a new business, have confidence in your abilities. That's exactly what they are talking about, my dear. Great, so the energy this week is all about this. It's all about going further into your knowledge. It's all about improving yourself through understanding more, through researching, through studying, through reading, through practicing. This energy is all around you watching the video now. So you have to go for it. It's time to take action. Take action in this direction, in going deeper into your knowledge, deeper into your creativity, into what is resonating with your heart. Learning more, studying more, going for it. Okay, don't stay stuck. Enough of procrastinating. Don't leave it for tomorrow anymore. Don't leave it for next month. Don't leave it for when you can, because your ego will always give you reasons to tell you this is not the right time. You cannot do it right now. So take this message into your heart and understand how important it is for you to be doing these trainings, these studies right now. This is gonna be bringing you closer to your uh, purpose, closer to your dreams. You, you have to do it, okay? Don't delay. Like I told you, the energy is very strong in this regards now. So use this energy in your favor because once the time of taking action in regards to deepening your knowledge, once this energy slows down, then you will never do it. <laughs> then you are not going to feel like doing it anymore. You're going to leave it behind. So if you feel like doing something new, do it this week. Okay. And let me know in the comments below. Remember, come to the video and tell me what is it you're planning to do. Cause I want to know what kind of trainings, what kind of studies, what kind of lectures or books you are planning to be reading and to be understanding more about yourself, about your career, about your work, about your knowledge. Okay. Let me know. Cause I want to know. Now I'm interested since they're talking so much about it. And again, okay, seven of action, more action. I'm telling you, they are pushing you forward. You cannot deny it. You cannot delay it anymore. You have to go for it. So it's saying you're being called upon to claim your personal power. Feel confident as your angels will give you the strength to say no when it's the right thing to do for yourself. Your struggle may actually stem from an unresolved inner conflict rather than rather than a conflict with others my dear like i told you your ego is going to give you all the reasons not to do it your ego is going to give you all the reasons not to go for it to wait to delay to leave it for some other time you can find a thousand reasons but grab the reasons why you really want to do it why you what do you really want from this kind of energy from this understanding from this knowledge from this inner growth what do you want from it and keep your attention in there because inside of you your ego will give you a thousand reasons not not to do it and not only your ego people they're saying people around you might also not support you 100 percent in doing this but in the end of the day, it is your life, it is your path, it is your purpose, it is what your heart is asking you to do now. So listen to it, okay? Be strong, find your strength within uh, yourself, within why you want to do it, why you want to grow, why you want to move forward, okay? And keep your focus in that. If you explain to people these reasons why, what you're gonna get from these trainings, what you're gonna get from going deeper into this knowledge or even changing your career into something else. If you explain from a loving perspective why you're changing or why you're going for it and what do you want from it, people will understand, my dear. Of course, 
it's not about it, it, don't don't say don't talk about it as if you are uh, fighting as if you are in a war with the other person explain coming from love explain saying why and this is important to you this is something you really believe this is something you really want to do and go for it do not procrastinate do not leave it for tomorrow because I I'm telling you the tomorrow will never come you will be pushing it forward and forward and you will never end up doing it the time is now the time is this week to take action to do the things you want to do okay my dear remember this take this message into your heart take action go for it okay do not delay do not wait for the right time because the right time is now there is all this energy there's so much energy coming around you pushing you forward the angels are pushing you forward telling you go for it go for it you cannot see it yet but once you start you will see that you did right this was the right thing to do and you you will feel so connected you will feel so proud of yourself because you actually chose to go for it you chose to do these trainings to do these courses to learn more to deepen your knowledge you will see how wonderful it's going to be okay my dear remember a lot of action for you this week that's your homework <laughs> let's move on for wednesday and thursday now let's see what they say oh, yeah. I, I, oh i'm telling you there's so much but these are not the cards this is the cards all right so ah wonderful manifest your dreams so it says you're ready to go that's what i'm talking about you're ready to go there is no need for additional preparation remember i just told you this your ego will tell you you're not ready but you are there is no need for more preparation take the first steps towards the changes you desire even if there are small steps do something about it don't stay stuck anymore don't continue to live a life where you're not happy about it even if it's baby steps but go do something different move yourself in the direction of what you want why not you deserve it you know it you're worthy go for it my dear don't delay it's time for action it's time to make things happen Notice signs that guide you in the right direction, as well as resources and support that miraculously appear. That's exactly what I'm telling you. The, the opportunities will come. You will find the trainings you want to do. You will find uh, the work, you know, new opportunities to change your career. You will find uh, people that resonate with you, people that understand what you want to do, that will help you. This is going to come to you. All of this, there's so much support coming. So don't delay. It's your dream. It's your life. Do not worry. Do not doubt it. Do not, don't stay stuck. Okay, they're telling me this. Like, please, please don't stay stuck. Please move on. Please start begin you know they are talking so much about this lately for so long actually now for a couple of months they're talking about taking action they are talking about going for it it's enough of delaying it's time oh i'm gonna repeat this over and over take action do not stay stuck enough enough move on go for it change your life it's in your hands do something different do what you want to do okay it's not tomorrow your your life is not tomorrow don't base your life in the tomorrows your life is right now if you want to change your life if you want something different in your life right now change it now change it today okay remember do something about it baby steps slowly you will move forward and you will see that just the first steps will be slow just the first steps will be baby steps the next ones you will be in the flow already and you will grow you will be moving forward you will be getting to where you want in a very natural way in a very supportive way the energy is 100 percent prepared right now supporting you right now for it so don't delay it anymore okay my dear anyways let's move on let me get a card now for the weekend and let's see
Okay, I'm back. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Let's move on for our weekend. My camera was <laughs> was switching off, so I had to stop the video. Sorry. Okay, weekend is here. Let's move on. I got it. Okay, I'm not gonna stop. I'm gonna continue. Four of thought. Spend time in nature. Oh, so good for the weekend. Spend time in nature, listening for guidance from your angels in your own inner voice. Because over again, overanalyzing the situation won't provide the answers you're seeking. Consider taking a vacation or a small break to help you rejuvenate and become clear on what your next step should be. Meditation can be very helpful. My, my dear, oh, I meditate on the weekend, go to nature, be in contact with your angels there, stay in your own silence, listening to the sound of nature, go outside, breathe some fresh air, you will feel recharged, you will feel ready. Nature has this power to recharge us, to make us feel strong. And this is what they're asking you during the weekends, because I know during the week is not that easy, but do something on the weekend that is gonna provide you this connection with yourself. You will find the strengths, you will find the angels if you're in nature, if you're outside. So do something on the weekend that is gonna nourish yourself, that is gonna uplift your spirits, is gonna uplift your energy, so you can feel even more ready, you can feel even more prepared to continue on your journey, to continue on your studies, on the things you need to do. So do not, uh, don't stay home on the weekend, okay? Do something, go out, have fun, okay? Enjoy yourself. Remember, you will not find your answers like they're saying. You will not, things are not going to happen in your life. Things are not going to change in your life if you stay right here thinking about it, analyzing it. Because you will never find the answers. There is no way. You won't find any answers. You won't get anywhere. The only way to get somewhere is by taking action and by listening to your heart. The heart holds the answers. So go out in nature, connect with yourself, recharge, breathe fresh air, connect with your angels, meditate with them, and then you will feel the inspiration. You will feel that the doubts are disappearing and you feel ready, you will feel ready to take action, to move on, to do the things that you have to be doing already. That is part of who you are. You can't deny it anymore. You know that you want this. You know that this is who you are. So go for it. Okay, my dear, remember, this is the way. By taking care of yourself, recharging your energy, connecting with yourself on a deeper level through meditation with your angels, and taking action, going for it. Do not delay it anymore. Okay, my dear, that's really good. Thank you so much for joining in the guidance for this week. I know that I had some technical issue with the camera that was about to switch off, but that's fine, okay? The message is here, the message is out there for you, okay? I hope it's touching your heart, I hope it's making sense to you. And I wish you a wonderful week, full of energy, full of actions, okay? Take good care of yourself. If you would like to receive daily angel guidance, you can go to my Instagram and my Facebook. If you would like to receive your own angel guidance, your personal angel guidance for yourself, you can always send me an email or go to my website to book a private guidance with me. Okay, it's going to be a pleasure to work with you. And it's like I told you, let me know in the comments below, what is it that you are planning to do this week? Okay, what are your plans for the week? Okay, take good care of yourself. Thank you so much for being here. I'll talk to you soon. Namaste.